Um, the guitar is an instrument that's played by a lot of bands, and um, it's a wide, uh, a widely used instrument. Um, there are many different types of guitars, like uh, an acoustic guitar or a bass guitar. This is an electric guitar. Um, it it hooks up to an amp, which makes a different noise, and I'll uh, show you that later. Um, the guitar is said to have originated in Spain um, a long, long time ago, but the first guitar was before recorded history, and it was said to be like a gourd uh, with a couple of, of uh, vines or strings on it, and when plucked, it made a noise. Um, so then when Future hit, they started making newer guitars with uh, technology and uh, different things like that. So I'll show you the different parts of the guitar. Um, start with uh, right here. These are tuning pegs. Um, the tuning pegs um, create a different noise if you wrap the strings. If you twist, the strings get tighter or looser and make a different um, noise when you pluck them. Um, the the nut, this is a nut. Um, it uh, holds the strings in place along the fretboard and down to the bridge. Um, this is a fretboard, this brown piece right here. Um, it holds um, the frets and uh, the strings. So a fret, um, when you place place your finger by a fret and pluck it, it makes a different noise every time. So, um, all of this is based on the neck. Um, this is the neck right here. And uh, that ho holds the frets, the fretboard, and uh, lines up the strings and the nut. Um, this is the head, which also houses the tuning pegs. and. Um, kind of looks neat. Um, this is uh, this is the body of the guitar. Um, it holds the um, pick guard and um, all and the pickups and the pickup switch and the volume controls and the amp plug. Um, the pick guard uh, helps from when you scratch, from not scratching the pick on the guitar and wrecking the finish. Um, the pickups um, are, have a little magnet on each of them that uh, um, pick up a different sound off of each of the strings when you play them. So, um, and then that feeds into the amp, which makes a lot of noise. Um, this is the bridge which houses the um, strings after they pass by the pickups and um, when you break a string you can uh, feed uh, the string back through each this is a pack of strings each pack um, has a um, string a different size string with a ball on the end and you feed the ball through here and up to the tuning pegs and wrap it around and you have a new string. Um, these are the volume controls. They You can turn them louder, softer, depending on um, what you want your guitar to sound like and same with the tone. Um, the pickup switch switches from reading the back pickups and the front pickups where no matter where you put it. Um, the amp plug feeds into the amp and uh, this is a strap. Um, if you stand up with the guitar like this, it hangs because it's, it's a little heavy, so you wouldn't want to, and it's slippery, so you wouldn't want to hold the guitar up while trying to play, which would be hard to do. Um, it also has a nice pick holder right here. I can put my pick in like this, like this. And uh, that's pretty neat. So, um, yeah, that's the basics of the guitar. Um, and this is a pick. You can play the guitar with a pick, or you can play the guitar with your thumb and index finger, or with your thumb, or you can do a different picking style with the index and thumb.
if you needed to play a song that had that kind of picking style. Um, so yeah, that's the guitar. Now I'm going to show you um, how the amp works. Um, when you play a guitar without an amp, it sounds... Um, well, I mean, you can play an electric guitar without an amp, but an acoustic was more made for playing without an amp. So, um, when you play an electric guitar without an amp, it sounds similar to an acoustic, but not as deep. Um, with an amp, which is short for amplifier, you can amplify the sound of the electric guitar um, and make it really loud and change around, like, the different style, t like, of uh, play. Um, like a really distorted or just regular clean play which sounds like an acoustic guitar. You can pretty much make an electric guitar sound like any different type of guitar um, depending on what note and what style you play with. Um, so this is a Vox amp. Um, it's really small but it puts out a lot of sound. There's uh, different controls on here. Style, uh, tone, and then the master volume. Um, there's different effects like uh, um, like a wow 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 kind of effect that you get with a whammy bar. This guitar doesn't have a whammy bar on it. But um, if you had a whammy bar, you can make it do that without the amp. Um, so turn on your amp and uh, plug it in. Get a little feedback, but not much. So um, this is uh, set on kind of what an acoustic guitar would sound like. Um, with a little... It's a little louder. Control everything from master area right here, and um, different things. This is what a whammy bar would sound like. So um, then uh, there's different types of uh, things like this high gain um, is more of a is more of a um, distorted sound. Blink-182, the band, uses that um, in most of their songs. Um, that's what it wow, but this is uh, just a regular uh, distorted sound. So, um, so that's pretty much the, what the amp can do. It can play a lot of different uh,
some other people are too. But so uh, yeah, get a guitar if you think it's cool, and um, it's a fun hobby to do. So I'd recommend it.